The hunger machine shown here gathering food is a mechanical representation of man's psychological and biological drives for food. Controlled by a system of weights and a balance in the cab of the vehicle, when the hunger side of the balance is down, a gear engages, driving the machine forward to find food. As food is shoveled into the receiving tray, it gradually tips, releasing the weights in the cab and altering the balance pans so that the satiety side descends. This disengages the machine from its food gathering activity. Similarly, man's hunger is controlled by a balance between the hunger center and the satiety center in the hypothalamus of the brain. When man is hungry, cues from the hunger center stimulate searching and feeding behavior. When satisfied, the body cues the satiety center. There is a feeling of fullness and feeding stops. Likewise, the thirst machine is a mechanical representation of a man's psychological urge to drink. When the machine is thirsty, as shown here, the primary side of the balance is down and the water tap opens. The tank fills and via pulleys begins to raise the primary arm. Simultaneously, water overflowing from the full tank turns the water wheel, pulling down the secondary arm. The tap closes and drinking ceases. On a similar balance principle, the thirst mechanism in man is controlled by the hypothalamic thirst center, or primary arm, and the cerebral cortex, or secondary arm, which regulates the body's intake of fluids. According to the quantity of fluid in the body, body mechanisms cue these controlling areas to stop or to start drinking.